Hi everyone. I'm Jonathan's Media Shack here once again. And today, I am going to do a double rant. This time, it'll be on Abby Hatcher, and Fish Hooks. And if you like any of these shows, that's fine by me, I'm glad that you like them, just don't go bash my opinion on them, because it's not fair if you bash my opinion on it, because we all have different taste you know. So, anyways, first, I will rant on Avi Hatcher. So, anyways, enjoy. So basically what the plot for this show is, Avi Hatcher is a little girl who has a big heart, and she tries to help her friends learn from their mistakes, and mishaps while also helping them to negotiate their emotions. In Avi's world, humans coexist with fuzz lies, creatures that have their own unique ability that makes them special. Avi's parents own a hotel where many fuzz lies live, including her best friend, Bosley, who joins her adventures as they help others through life, and that's it, that's basically what the plot for this show is all about. Now, what are my thoughts on this show? Well, I have to say, that this is a very stupid show. I'll tell you the reasons why. 1. I find the animation for this show to be really repulsive. I mean, oh my god, the animation looks like it came from a poorly made children's video game, and it also looks flashy. Whoever did the animation, couldn't do a much better animation than this, because this is disgusting, and shitty. 2. The character's designs looks really ugly. I mean, who the hell made these characters like that? All of them look so terrible. And they all look like plastic puppet animation as well, just like the animation of this show itself. 3. I find the theme song to be nothing but a pile of bullshit. 4. I find the episodes to be very cliché, boring, irritating, and very stupid. Nothing interesting happens in this show whatsoever, all it is, is them, doing random shit, and that's it. 5. I find this show to be absolutely charmless. And even when it tries to be charming, it's not charming whatsoever, it's just a dull cliché Nick Jr. show that's nothing to it whatsoever in my opinion. 6. The characters in this show are very annoying, especially when it comes to them doing random shit, they are still very annoying characters to me. 7. I find this show to be one of Nickelodeon's cash grab, just like some other shitty Nickelodeon shows that are cash grabs. 8. The way that the characters moves at times is just really awkward. 9. I find the plot, and the writing, for this show to be nothing but a pile of bullshit. I mean, literally, what the fuck is this shit? Who comes up with stupid shit like that? Huh. That's just wrong. I mean, yes, I get it, it's a kid show, but, come on, you can do a lot better than this, this is disgraceful. And finally, 10. I find this show to be one of the worst Nick Jr. shows, along with Dora the Explorer, and some other ones, and also one of the worst shows from 2019. And, so, for my final rating for Abby Hatcher, I'm going to give it, a 1 out of 7. What a terrible show. Next, I will be ranting on fish hooks. So, anyways, enjoy. So basically what the plot for this show is, a trio of fish, brothers Milo and Oscar, along with the dramatic BEA, attend school in an aquarium in a pet store. They cope with the usual trials of teens, like dating, friendship, sports and school issues, along with some more unusual things, like giant lobster attacks, and field trip to hamster cages, and that's it, that's basically what the plot for this show is all about. Now, what are my thoughts about this show? Well, in my opinion, I find this show to be pretty obnoxious, and bad. I'll tell you the reasons why. 1. I find the animation for this show to be poorly drawn. I mean, come on, who used this animation for this garbage? 
They could have at least put a little bit of effort into this, but no, and the way that they've done it looks so terrible. And I'm ashamed about this, because this is a Disney cartoon, and usually Disney cartoons comes out as very funny, or good, but with this, this is no comedy gold, I'm sorry to say. Disney is also usually very good with their animation for their movies, but why did they wasted their talent with this? What a huge mistake. 2. I find the theme song to be pretty cringe as hell. It sounds like a lost trashy music that was from the 80s, and used it for this show, and it sounds very cringe, and lame. Like, come on, that's not a way to go. I mean, I understand that they were trying their best, but unfortunately, it just wasn't good enough. 3. I find the episodes to be very stupid, and cringe-worthy at times, especially with the characters doing random shit throughout the episodes, just like that piece of shit Abby Hatcher show does. 4. I even find the humor to be very nauseating, crude, and just really weird. I mean, what's even funny about this show in the first place? I just don't get it? Well, at least I don't. 5. There is too many pun jokes in this show, and it gets so irritating, and it never ends. 6. The characters in this show are very irritating, ill-mannered, loud, bossy, anger-worthy, and stupid. I couldn't find a character that was actually likable in this show. 7. I find this show to be charmless once again. Even when it tries to be charming, it's really not, and there is more Disney cartoons that are actually more charming than this, this is just bullshit. 8. I find the directing, writing, and the plot to be nothing but a huge mess. I mean what were they doing while making this garbage? It felt like someone was spilling coffee all over the plot, or writing, and they grabbed it, and gave it to that director, and he reads it, and he greenlits it, and they make this stupid show called Fish Hooks. Wow, talk about effortless right there. And finally, 9. I find this show to be one of the worst Disney cartoons, and also one of the worst shows from the 2010s. And, so, for my final rating for Fish Hooks, I'm going to give it, a 1 out of 7. What a terrible show. So, anyways, that's all for today's video. See you guys later.